it turns out that the Hamiltonian path problem and the traveling salesman problem are both hard problems. We have yet to come up with a polynomial time solution. Notice, that includes things like n to the 100 and n to the 10 to the 10 to the 10 to the 10 and so on and so on. No matter what value you plug in, we have no polynomial time solution to any of these problems. These are all considered very hard problems, but most of them sound very easy. So some of these, for example, Hamiltonian path, sounds like it should be very doable. It's just, can I find a path that hits every vertex and does it only once? It doesn't sound like that's hard. Similarly, things like the three coloring problem. Given a graph, can I color it with three colors so that they're never touching? That sounds like it should be very easy. It's not. Some of these other problems in other fields, so these are all graph problems. This is some graph problems. Let's look at some other ones. What if we had a, something we might have looked at in Foundations 1? A truth statement, just a bunch of variables and and or together, maybe with some negations in there. What if we had that? Can I determine values for those variables to make it true or false? Seems like it should be easy, right? Like that's a foundation of computer science logic and circuits. And maybe not, it turns out to be really hard. Another problem sounds really easy, given a bunch of numbers and an integer. Can I find a subset of those numbers that adds up to the uh, M? Seems like it should be really easy, really hard. No polynomial time algorithm to do it. Some of these other ones look very easy, given a, B, and C are integers. Can I solve this quadratic equation with integers? That's it. Just solve a quadratic equation. It turns out, again, to be too hard to be solvable in a polynomial time algorithm. This is what we are going to call NP problems. We have yet to show that any of these can be solved in polynomial time, which is very unfortunate. In fact, these all turn out to be NP complete problems, which is an even harder type of problem that we'll talk about very shortly.